Hi, uh, welcome to the session on CMA part 2, uh, Financial Decision Making. In today's session, we discuss about corporate restructuring. Corporate restructuring. A corporate is going to be restructured either by merging into the other company or the company may be consolidated or company may be taken over by the other company. Corporate restructuring. The reasons for corporate restructuring can be for uh, you know the synergy, operating synergy or financial synergy. So in this we have multiple companies so so that the combination will create a synergy. In the next sessions we'll discuss that whether that synergy will help both the companies or justifies the combination business combination or there is no justified combination then how a company can fight against a forcible combination forcible combination in a sense you lose your rights you lose your rights you lose your powers how to fight with them that's an issue how to fight with them what ammunition you have to fight against a forcible combinations, business combinations, various, you know, uh, types of, you know, uh, the uh, actions you can take to fight against a forcible business combinations that we'll discuss in the coming sessions. Uh, in this session, we discuss about the types of combinations, business type, business combinations. The four more common types of business combinations include a merger, a consolidation, the acquisition of common stock of a company, or the acquisition of assets. Let's discuss one by one in detail what a merger is, what a consolidation is, and what the acquisition of common stock and assets are. We call them as legal forms of business combination, wherein one uh, business is going to be uh, uh, in the hands of the other company or is going to be consolidated or the assets or you know the control power is taken over by the other company in detail the the the, the characteristics of merger of business combination include it is about you know the uh, creating the uh, kind of synergy Synergy in a sense, the power, the power. So this can be an operational synergy or a, a financial synergy, which will help the companies to be together to make more revenues and more profits. Here, the merger. Merger is nothing but a company is going to merge with the other company, wherein one company will exist and the other company or companies will cease to exist. One company will still exist, the other companies will cease to exist. Like in this case, in this merger, there were two companies, company A, company B. Company A and company B uh, have agreed for a business combination. Agreement took place between these two companies, but only one company will survive the other company will cease to exist so what does it mean the shares of company b are going to be delisted from stock exchange company's operations will be closed down all the resources will be transferred to company a the employees may get employment in company a or may be compensated the investors may be compensated or will be given uh, in the company CA shares. Likewise, the suppliers, you know, bankers, etc., will be justified. So, in merger, one company survives, the other companies will cease to exist. Means there will be no uh, life to the remaining companies which are just merged with the other company. 